Hello, welcome back. Today I bring you a C++ application which obtains stock market information from 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 websites in real time. It's a complex tool with an automatic system of data manager in uh, which uses it in order to update the new information by, by adding new rows to the old ones. This is part of the update system. I also use a file reader and writer uh, which I made and I think is the fastest in the in the world. I have contrasted with other ones and it's very fast. Another important fact in this application is the fast of of the request. The application connects uh, via socket to a web page which provides stock market data. It downloads using a multi-thread algorithm and only takes a few seconds to get a company full data. It also stores the resulting using the famous format JSON. In the main CPP we can see the the simply user manual a, a simply user manual where you can see the the company name you you only have to to write the company name when you create the class and then execute it uh, then it will it will automatically uh, save the data that previously is of the, uh, was obtained via socket and stores in in in, a f in this file in the file data I'm going to execute it as you can see it is very fast it's a, it has a, a lot of ta a different types of data like the book, financial, uh, previous seasons, dividends, uh, the charts we can also see the news about the company so let's let's look the result of this here it has created a lot of files and directories uh, let's see the J JSON la data as you can see it's too big to file so it takes a, a long time to load it We can also look for other other companies' names in the symbols. For example, let's look to this company. ADMS. Adamas Pharmaceuticals. The only thing we need to change is this and then execute the program program normally and finish now let's look to the result here is the the, na the company name in in the stock market and look at all the folders that we've seen uh, uh, before we can look to the dividends 
in this case it, ha it has no dividends the chart you can see it's huge this file this is the the largest file that we can see in this application uh, we can look for the price of the company I don't know in which monetary ah, I think he, it uses dollars to millions of dollars for for this for this number so that's all you can download this this application this library for free in in my github, GitHub repository uh, that's written that it's written in in the description of this in, of this video so thank you thank you so much and see you in the next video